it's Amy from The Big Bakes. Today I'm going to be making a classic Victoria sponge. Um, this is a really, really simple recipe um, and I'm going to show you how easy it can be. For this you will need caster sugar, butter, self-raising flour with a bit of baking powder. I've been using um, our home pride self-raising flour that we use in the tent. Um, four eggs, some milk, some jam, some double cream and also a little bit of vanilla essence as well. The equipment you'll need is um, a large mixing bowl, a wooden spoon, a spatula. You'll also need two um, pre-greased and pre-lined uh, baking tins. Uh, to line them, all you need to do is literally just draw around the base of the tin, cut it out and then pop it in the bottom, give it a good grease as well. And then you'll also need a cooling rack for when your cakes are cooling. Let's get started. Now I'm gonna start by putting my sugar and my butter together. I like to cream them together. It just helps to sort of get them going. So once you've creamed your butter and sugar together, you can add, then add your flour and baking powder. I'm now going to crack my eggs into my milk and then I'm gonna add them into the mixture. Okay, so now I have a lovely smooth batter. I'm now going to split it between my two tins. Okay, so now I've put the mixture into both my tins. I'm going to make sure they stay flat and I'm going to put them in the oven. So my cakes are ready. I'll take them out of the oven. I'm going to leave them to cool for a little bit in the tin and then move them onto a cooling rack to cool down properly. Um, in the meantime, I'm now going to whip my cream for the filling. I'm just taking some double cream and I'm just going to whip it until it goes nice and firm. You don't want to over whip it though. There we go. So my cream is lovely and firm now. That's going to sit lovely on my Victoria sponge. So now that my cakes have cooled, it's time to fill them. So I'm going to take one of them and decide it's going to be my bottom. I'm going to do this one. And I'm just going to gently shave off um, the top just so it's nice and flat for the other one to sit on top. So now I'm going to put them onto a plate. And I'm going to start with my base. And I'm going to top this one with cream. And then this one, I'm going to top with jam. And then I'm just going to pop this one on top. And then to finish it off, I'm just going to dust it with a little bit of ice. And there you have it, a Victoria sponge made at home. If you want to take on one of our bakes at home, make sure you tag us and show us what you've been baking. See you next time!